What's up guys? Mr. U143. So for today, uh, we are going to discuss the concept of the operation and function. So operation and functions. So recall that um, recall that we have the four fundamental operations on the set of the real numbers. Then of course, we have also operation on functions. So given two functions f and g so we may form new functions to uh, define as follows so this these are the following functions so the first one is um, g of x is equal to f of x plus g of x the second one is the f m of x is equal to f of x minus g of x and the third one, n of x, is equal to f of x, j of x. So this implies as multiplication. So we have addition, subtraction, and multiplication. As well as the t of x is equal to f of x over g of x, where g of x is not equal to 0. Of course, in a fraction, always, dapat ang nasa denominator niya is not equal to 0. So these are the functions. So, we're going to use, we're gonna use this um, formulas or functions. So, for example, for example, um, this one, okay, so, um, if f of x is equal to 5x minus 4 and g of x is equal to 2x minus x squared. So, the value of the f of x, the function, uh, f of x is equal to 5x minus 4 and the g of x is equal to 2x minus x squared. Okay, so find the following functions. So, dito muna tayo sa number 1 or sa letter A. We have the quantity f plus g then quantity 3. So, this implies that the value of x here is 3. Okay, so function g, f and of course function g. Okay, so let's um, compute or um, simplify or subject the value. Okay, so sagutan mo natin itong um, um, first uh, itong letter a. Okay, so sasagutan natin ngayon ang sa letter a. So, um, Gamitin natin since plus ya so addition so h of x is equal to f of x plus g of x okay so we check the values of the function or f of x we have 5x minus 4 5x minus 4 okay plus um, g of x natin is 2 2x minus x squared 2x minus x squared okay. then again subject the value the value implies uh, the value of the x is 3 we have 5 quantity 3 minus 4 plus bracket we have 2 times 3 minus 3 then squared okay, then um, 5 times 3 is uh, 15 then minus 4 plus um, plus 2 times 3 is 6 minus 3 times 3 so time itself we have 9 then quantity 15 minus um, 4 is 11 then plus then um, 6 minus 9 is 3 so negative 3 kasi mas malaki ang 9 so negative 3 then so um then um uh, 11 then positive times negative 3 is negative then negative 3 then um, um, 
11 minus 3 is 80. So, that natin is 8. So, ibig sabihin ng h of x is x. So, next, sagutin natin ng sa b. So, ngayon, ang gagamitin natin ngayon is yung yung m of x um, is equal to f x minus g of x kasi minus so subtraction so m of x then equal to f of x minus g of x then ang value ng f of x natin is 5 x minus 4 quantity then minus Ang value ng ano natin is 2x minus x squared. So, katulad pa rin ng kanina. We have 5. Subject natin ng value. So, negative 2 na siya. 5 times 2. Then, 4. Yan. Then, minus um, 2 times negative 2. Then, minus then negative 2, then squared bracket okay okay then next um, 5 times uh, negative 2 is negative 10 then minus 4, copy lang then next minus 2 times negative 2 is negative negative 4 then minus uh, negative 2 times negative 2 is 4 times negative. So that's negative 4. Okay, next, um, negative 10 minus 4 is, yad natin kasi pare sila ng sign. Yung negative, copy the sign, and then add. So 14. Okay, then minus negative 4, negative 4, so we have negative 8. Okay, then um, negative 14, negative times negative 8 is positive 8, then equal uh, 14, negative 14 plus 8 is negative 6, negative 6, kasi mas malaki ang negative. 14, so kunin natin ang sign and then subtract natin sila. Then, yan. So, ang m of x natin is equal to negative 6. Okay, so next, sagutin natin ng tercy naman, we have um, f um, f g then equal, or the x is, uh, the value of x is 1. So, f g implies uh, Times. So, ang gamitin natin is yung n of x. Okay, ang n of x. See, n of x natin ay implies um, multiplication. Okay, so n of x then equal f times f of x times g of x. Then, subject the value. Kanina, we have ang n of x natin is 5x minus 4 and then ang g of x natin is um, 2x minus x squared okay, it's have the value value nya is 1 5 times 1 minus 4 times 2 times 1 minus 1 times 1 okay, then simplify 5 times 1 is 5 minus 4 then 2 times 1 is 2 then minus 1 times 1 is 1 then next 5 minus 4 is 1 then 2 minus 1 is 1 okay then 1 times 1 is 1 so meaning n of x natin is equal to 1 Okay, so next, last one, letter D, uh, F, G, then 5. So, ang gamitin natin is V of X is equal to F of X uh, over G of X, then where G of X is not equal to 0. 
So we have ID um, P of X is equal to F of X over G of X. So we get the values we have f of x is 5x minus 4 then over 2x minus x squared next the, the value of the uh, x we have 5 5 times 5 minus 4 over 2 times 5 minus uh, 5 squared Next, 5 times 5, 25 minus 4 over 2 times 5 is 10 minus 5 times 4 is 25. So next, so what's the next? Okay, so 25 minus 4 is 21. Then over um, 10 minus 25 is negative okay so kasi negative 25 mas matas negative 25 kaya naging negative 15 next simple as form kailangan always ang final sagot is naging simple as form so simple as form niya so divide natin 3 so 21 uh, divided by 3 is equal to 7 then um, negative 15 uh, divided by 3 is equal to um, negative 5. Okay, so yung final na sagot natin is this one. So, P of X is equal to 7 over negative 5 or uh, negative 7 over 5. Or negative 7 over 5. I hope you understand the concept of the operation function.